Hello everyone, it's Joy in the Villages bringing you our weekly market update news and along with some local news as well. So before we begin, I'm always asked, how is the market doing? Our market is doing quite well, thank you. We have a nice normal market. We have about a two or three month inventory. We have listings coming on each week. We have buyers buying them each week. We've even got multiple offer situations going on. We're on a market about 60 days, and I shall go into some of those numbers in a moment. But for all of you that live here, this is a normal, nice market. Your house will sell if you've priced it well and it shows well. So if you've got those two items, it's priced well and it shows well, you should sell your property in this market without too much of an issue. If you have questions, contact your own agents or call me, I'd be happy to, to speak to you. So let me go over some of the numbers that we did just last week. We brought 40 new listings to the market. We sold 38. We put into escrow or pending, we've got 41. So you can see it's all very, we've got 40 coming in, we sold 38, we sold, uh, we put 40 into escrow. It's all very good. Days on the market, about 60 days still. If you're priced well, you show well, you should be on the market 30 days. That's it. Um, back on the market, we did have some people that had to cancel. Uh, we did have about eight properties that returned to the market last week. Price decreases, sellers are coming to terms that it's not the same market as it was two years ago. So we had 51 of those. And also we have properties right now on the market about 329. Two or three weeks ago, we were talking about almost 360. So you can see right now that the inventory is beginning to shift. That's about a 10% shift. A couple of things I wanted to note. We have buyers coming in who are very energy conscious. They are looking at high utility bills and they want to save on their maintenance costs. As a result, solar energy, water saving features, all of those areas are very important to a lot of buyers coming into the area and developers are taking notice and starting to bring that into their construction. So as we move forward, you will see more developers offering solar, offering water saving features or energy saving, energy saving features. Very interesting the way the market shifted a little bit in that area there. I put a fabulous video on my newsletter uh, showing life in the villages. A photographer came into town, he worked with this lovely young woman and they just went through the villages and they looked at everything that was going on from the town centres to the villages to the golf courses. They even captured pictures of the alligators coming out of the water. But it's a fun uh, video of the villages and I'd love your input because so often I think the villages gets a pretty bad rap and I live here, all of my friends live here and we love it. So let me know what you think, but it is posted on my newsletter, which is always attached to this video, and I'd love you to watch it. it, it it's a, it really is kind of insightful, and you realize what a bubble we're living in when you look at it. Um, I put an article out there today, uh, sellers, if nobody else is listing, that's the time to sell your house. Now read the article. I always bring you something from some of the experts to look at. But if you don't see any activity in your neighborhood, that's the time that you list your house. If everybody's selling around you, you've got to be a little more careful. So read the article because it, you never know. You know, you may be the only person on the street that's on the market and somebody may want that particular area. We have the Philharmonic at the Sharon tomorrow evening. Uh, all of the magic moments of opera, definitely worth going to see. Oh my God, that theater is so beautiful. If you have any questions on real estate or what's going on here, do feel free to call me Joy Farringdon with Remax Premier Realty 760-702-4657. I'd be glad to speak to you or discuss this video or whatever you like. Thank you so much. Bye bye. See you next week.